Machu Picchu is often described as a ceremonial city, a royal retreat, or a spiritual site. But its most impressive feature isn't symbolic at all. It's structural. Many of the tightest stone joints at Machu Picchu are not stacked on soil. They are locked directly into living rock, carved from bedrock outcrops that were never moved. Some walls are partly built and partly natural mountain, blended so precisely that the seam almost disappears. This choice wasn't aesthetic. It made the city more stable in one of the most earthquake-prone regions on Earth. Modern engineers who've studied the site point out something else. The Inca didn't just anchor buildings to bedrock. They integrated drainage channels into it, allowing water to pass through the mountain instead of pooling around foundations. What's hard to explain is why this level of geological planning shows up so consistently, especially without metal tools or written engineering manuals. Machu Picchu doesn't look improvised, it looks deliberate. We know what they built, we know it works. What we still don't fully know is how this knowledge spread or how early it developed.